good morning, good afternoon, good evening, according to your time, wherever you are watching me from. I bless everyone in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. Before I go to this topic, let's say the short of prayer. Father, mighty God, I bless you, I worship you, I adore you. I give all the glory, honor, and adoration. I thank you for the gift of life. I thank you for your grace upon my life, upon my family, upon my loved ones, upon the, the viewers that is watching me. Father, we thank you because there is no one like you. For as we are about to hear your word, O oh God, give us your understanding. We want to understand your word perfectly in the mighty name of Jesus Christ. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen. So, I, I made this video before. I'm still going to make it now. I want to talk about the meaning of single mother. The meaning of single mother. That is the topic of today. A lot of ladies, be you Europe or Africa or all over the world, keep on calling themselves a single mother, a single mother, a single mother. No. In my own understanding, I'm, I, you may not like what I'm going to say. Everybody is to be You understand? You have your own to say. If you, you may not, you may not agree what I'm going to say, but it's my own opinion. Um, a single mother. First and foremost, a single is a lady, a young lady or a young man that never married. Is still a single. He have not married yet. That's called single. Then if you ask somebody in your life, you pour her into, um, into a relationship. That is why you said, are you a single? No, I'm not a single. I'm into a relationship. I have somebody in my life. And if you, have, if you are into a relationship, and that relationship, you are building that relationship, and that relationship is, uh, is strong, that you both is planning to get married. That means you are that means you both are called fiancé. I have fiancé. You understand? I have fiancé, which means someone you accept that you are going to marry. You, you want to take to the altar. You both have, you are you are together for many years or for long. I don't let me put it like that. And you both have come to compromise that you are going to live live together, spend the rest of your life together. You are going to take her to the altar. That is, you call, it, call that fiancé. Now, if you marry, if you married, a man pay your bride price. You do the necessary thing. And you have children with the man. At the end, you want to lead to another. You put another together again. Then you call that the voice. You call that the voice. Also, if you have children with the man or you have baby with the man and the man did not marry you, that's called baby mama. You understand? That's called baby mama. That is why you see some girl that no, uh, where is your husband? He will said, I'm not married, and he's the father of my children. He did not marry me. Yes, she's saying the right thing because she did not marry her. She only have baby with the man. He's the father of your uh, 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 kids. You understand? Then, if the man marries you, as I said before, he marries you, have children with the man. And the man, you put one to the other, you put separate. That does not give you right to call yourself a single mother. You are not a single mother. That means, you that call the voice. I was I was one married before, but I'm the voice. That's called the voice because he married you. He pay you do the necessary thing. At the end, something happened. You are not you both are not together. Then you separate. That's called the voice. That does not give you right to call yourself a single mother because the man is still alive. Sometimes the man can come and visit the children, buy things for the children, tell the children out. Tell the children to his house to spend all the day with them, with him. Or give you some money, give you money every month to take up the children. 
does not mean that you are a single mother because the man is still alive. It does not give you right to call yourself a single mother. You are not. Even though the man is not taking care of the children, it does not give you right to call yourself a single mother because the man is still alive. The people that I know that is called a single mother, those are the called widow or widowers. Their husband is dead or their husband is late. All those things is called names. They are names. Widow, widower, single, uh, marry, uh, what they call it, um, uh, single, all those things. They are names. So those are the people they call widow. I said it before. The people they call widow. They call it widow. The people they call it single mother because their husband is late. There was only, only, it's only then that he's taking care of the children. You will see the woman will be strong, will go to a farm, farming to take care of the children, to raise the children up because no support, no husband again. Even though the husband, they are alive, they're not there to go that place, the man will see they take care of the children. Even though the man don't take care of the children, but sometimes, as please, the man, they see they are alive. But if the if the if the, the the woman or the man their husband is late, no support. Those are the call single mother because it's the only they are, it's the only day that is taking care of the children. With, without no support, they will see you see the mother going to market selling different type of things to take to to raise the children up. No support. Or the children will go to school after coming back to school, go and help the, their mother to support their, the, their mother in the market or in the farm. Those are the people they call single mother. Not you. The man is alive. Then you are calling yourself a single mother. Who told you that a single mother? No, you are not. Don't call yourself a single mother. Don't lay curse on yourself. Because the man is still alive. The woman is still alive. Claim yourself as a single mother. You are not a single mother. Stop it. Don't say it again. If you, if you both of you married, married and you are not together again, that is called that voice. It doesn't mean you are a single mother. You claim yourself. If you are calling yourself a single mother, what do you want to call the widows? The widowers. Without, the, without husband. Their husband is dead. What are you going to call them? Remember that widows, widowers, is name. You understand? You that have children with the man and the man did not marry you, that you call baby mama. Is the father of my children, but it's not my husband. You are calling yourself a single mother that you are not with the man, but you have my friend outside there that you are sleeping with. That you are calling yourself a single mother. No, you are not. Or you you have so uh, you are you with the wife is not longer again, but you have girlfriend outside the outside that is sleeping with you. Then you are calling yourself a single man. No, you are not. Stop it. I know one thing or the other happen that the you people separate, but it does not it does not give you that right to call yourself a single mother. It does not give you that right to call yourself a single man. You are not a single man. You are not a single woman. In my own understanding, a single man or a single woman is a woman that your husband is late, your husband is dead, no support in any way. They are, the woman is strongly to take care of the children, going to farm, investing, going to market. Rain will beat her. Son will son her. Son on her. I don't know what to say. Son will beat her there. You will go to market early in the morning, come back in the midnight to take care of his children. That is why you see some, some, some children with, without no support of the woman or support of the man. You understand? You will see they will, they will, be, they will be wayward. They will be the streets. For you know, they will start stealing because no help for the single woman. Because the woman cannot train, train, the, train the, uh, the, uh, the child, train the children. But you... As a as a as a as a, as a, as a woman, you have children with the man, even though the man did not marry you. You understand? You cannot compare yourself with uh, people that are in Africa, but at least European, you see you see uh, 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 help from the government. You can go to hospital without uh, you did not pay free of charge. 
But Africa not like that. Then you are calling yourself a single mother. Who told you that? What are people in Africa? No help, nothing, nothing. No help for the government, no, no, no nothing, nothing. The children in outside, sleeping outside, robbing, stealing, do a uh, 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 different type of thing to survive, to, 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 to keep them, to make them to, to, to survive. Then you are in Africa, Europe here, taking care of, of yourself. Uh, taking care, the government is taking care of you and me. You can work. They will pay good salary. The social is there. They will help you. Go to hospital free of charge. Go to pharmacy. Uh, pharmacy. That is a uh, pharmacy. They will give you medicine with that you did not pay. Living, they will come to give you house. You are living comfortable. Free water. Free light. No mosquito. Nothing, nothing. Then you are calling yourself a single mother. Who told you that you are a single mother? What are the people in Africa? Who is helping them? So if you are that woman, be grateful to God. Be thankful to God. Don't call yourself as a single mother. The man is alive. Even though the man is not taking responsibility of the children, it doesn't matter. But the, the man is still alive. He's still answering the, uh, the, uh, the man's name. He's still answering their father's name. And if you're that woman, you allow your children to answer your father's name. Stop it. No matter what. No matter whether the man take off the children or not, let them still answer their father's name. Because as, if somebody, somebody that brings them to this world, allow them to answer their father's name. It doesn't matter if the man is taking care of the children or not. So please, I'm not against any of anybody. I just want to advise one or two people. Stop giving yourself that insult. Stop uh, 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 using your mouth to say, uh, say, it's called, uh, saying sorry to yourself. You are not a single mother. You're not a single, single father. May God bless everyone in the mighty name of Jesus. I hope this message will educate one or two people out there. God bless you and bye.